in the front squat, this is going to engage our quads a little bit more than the back squat. It's also going to engage our core quite a bit. Now, the one thing with the front squat that can be difficult is getting the grip, um, which would be for another video, but I'll show you today a few methods to do that. So, now generally when you do a front squat, it will be racked in a bar in front of you. Now, when you go to set up, you want to make sure that first you walk up to it and put that bar pretty much into your trachea. It's a little uncomfortable once you get used to it. It's okay. Now, the best, what you'll notice is when you fold your arms up, bring them out straight here, there's a little notch that you find in your shoulder, and it kind of rests comfortably there. So you want to find that notch in your shoulder, and if you get that, you should almost be able to pick the bar out of the rack and hold it into what we call the Frankenstein position. So once you kind of have it there in the rack in the Frankenstein position, you can put one arm over on each side, and then you step on back, and you've got it here. Now what we're going to do is get into that regular front squat position, or any squat position, my feet are about shoulder width apart, I'm going to sit down, and what I'm doing here is driving my elbows up to the sky, keeping my back nice and straight. I'm sitting down in the squat, and then popping up. When the weight gets really heavy, it's going to be your elbows are going to be forced down. You're also going to lean forward. So focus as much as you can, keeping your weight back and the elbows up. That is how you do a barbell front squat.